Do you know why I didn't drag me here? You know psychics are fake. I've been here before and I think she's really cool. All I've really ever seen of psychics is that- Oh sh**! Don't you know they're- Hey Tina, who's your friend here? Yeah, this is Sheldon. Hi Sheldon. Hi. Is he getting a reading today too? No, we were just passing through. I thought we'd stop in for a minute. Well, let's head back then. Okay. This will just take a second. Okay, I'll wait out here. What were you interested in learning today? Well, I'm reading this Twilight series, and I'm on the third book, Eclipse, and I gotta know, it, does Bella choose Edward or Jacob? Well, according to my crystal ball here, she's not choosing either. She's gonna choose Paul. Really? I didn't see that one coming. No one did. Well, prom's coming up. I want to know, is Chet the quarterback going to ask me out? Well, it looks like a no. Okay. Will I at least have a beautiful dress to wear? No. Will anyone ask me to dance? Well, there's a chance for this one. No. Lots of kitties. Will there be any chance at all I can become prom queen? Or will I have any fun at all? Oh, yes! Really? No. Can we try something else? What is with her and the cat? Well, let's switch to my special tarot cards. I'm going to have you pick a pile. Okay. Um, let's do this one. Okay. You picked these three. What do they mean? Well, this here's the Himalayan. It means you're going to break your ankle. Ah. Uh, well, is that one any better? No, that's the tabby. You're going to go prematurely bald. What about that one? Well, this one's my favorite. His name's Mr. Putty. It means you're going to be an old maid. Well, is there anything else? Well, I can do a freckle reading. Let me see your arm. So you're an Aquarius? No, actually, I'm a Sagittarius. Oh, that was my next guess. I mean, telling. Oh, looks like there's a turn of luck for you. Really? Yeah, you're going to be asked to the prom by the captain of the mathletes. Okay. Um, can we go now? There's a lot of cats out in the waiting room. Actually, there's something in my crystal ball here for you, too. Yeah. Why don't you leave Sheldon here in your seat? You can wait in the waiting room. Okay, well, I've seen some magazine scripts. Uh, um, oh, okay. So there's, uh, something in that ball for me, huh? Well, there's someone from the other side who wants to contact you. Who is it? Let me try and channel them here. Was that Lady Gaga? Does Lady Gaga want to talk to me? No, 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 I'm sorry. There must have been some interference. Let me try again. Um, I think you got it wrong again. I'm pretty sure that was Kesha. I'm sorry, I'm only getting FM signals. Let me try again. Sheldon, this is your great Aunt Margaret. I know you never wore that okay. Christmas sweater I made you. Aunt Margaret? And I know you think I smelled like corned beef. Don't you know there? What a liar! Okay, is there anything else you can do? 
Well, I can do a palm reading. Okay. Hi, kitty. Not those stupid cats again. What are you doing? Um, you said you wanted to do a palm reading. Oh, is that how you do it? Okay, let's see here. It looks like your lifeline runs into your marriage line somewhere around here. Well, what exactly does that mean? Well, let me take another look there. Alright. Oh, well, this looks bad. What? Well, what do you mean? Well, it looks like you're going to be mauled by a bear soon. What? Don't you know? It's all right there. Alright, I gotta ask, what is with the cats? What cats? Um, okay, I'm out here. Oh, okay, have a good day. Uh-huh. Alright, Tina, I've had enough of this place. Let's go. Yeah, I just finished this book. She's a liar. Ow, my ankle. Oh my god, a bear. Told you so.